Oh man, another night working at Sleepy Hollow High. I was trying to quit this job yesterday, I went on Craigslist and I looked everywhere for a new job. Literally, there's no one else hiring except Sleepy Hollow High. And the weird thing is, they had a listing looking for two more janitors. Like they're just preparing for us to quit. Or worse. <sighs> I don't know how much more I can take of this. Where's Kid? We always meet outside the school before our shift starts. He should be here by now. I can't wait much longer. I have to punch in. I, I need to make this money. I have to stay afloat. <sighs> it makes you wonder. Why is this the only job available and why are they already looking for more people? <sighs> Man, well, I don't know if Kip's coming or not. Uh, maybe he's already in there. Maybe he went in without me. I guess I should just go inside. I don't want to be late. Oh, man. Uh, hey, uh, Newman. Hey there, Aviator. Did you hear the news? Uh, no, I didn't. Well, what news? You're going to be here all alone tonight, it looks like. What? Why? Kip has called in sick today. He said he wasn't feeling very well. He was kind of under the weather. So it looks like you're going to be on your own. <sighs> He's sick? Really? <sighs> I, I can handle it, I guess. Great, I'll see you in the morning, Aviator. Have a good night. Uh, okay, I'll see you in the morning, Mr. Newman. Uh, Kib is sick. Yeah, like, I believe that. Man. After what happened last night, I guess I would pretend to be sick too if I didn't really need the money. But didn't Kib say he needed this paycheck? To survive just like me? Why would he skip work? Maybe he really is sick. Uh, Whatever. I guess I'm gonna have to be alone in Sleepy Hollow High tonight. At least I have Janitor Dan with me. Hey, Aviator, uh, do you feel that? Uh, feel what? I don't know. Something just doesn't feel right. It's like something happened yesterday that changed the school. Uh, God, is he talking about us re releasing the spirits in that book? We didn't really know what that book did, and, and we still don't know what it... It has done, but maybe that's what's making Janitor Dan feel a little bit different. Um, I'm gonna play stupid. Uh, what could have happened? I'm not sure, but things are about to get a lot messier. A lot messier indeed. Well, uh, how can we get things back to normal? I don't know. Uh, I'm not sure if there's even a way to do that. But anyway, uh, can you start with the gym today? I think I'll handle the upstairs. Sure, uh, I'll get right on that. Oh, man. I guess I'm gonna tackle the mess in the gym today. It's really odd though if Janitor Dan feels different. He's been here like 30 years or lo longer. And to feel like a weird presence, that scares me because we did something last night. I don't know what we did, but something happened. And if he can feel it, that really, really scares me. Oh man. Well, let's clean the gym. I'm gonna pull out my tools, I guess, and hope we don't bump into anything. It's really scary not having Kib behind me. Okay. Oh my god, who's this? Why is this girl in the school so late? Um, hello? Hello, sir. Have you seen my friend? Your friend? What are you doing here so late? I'm looking for my friend, sir. I can't find him. How, how did you get in here? My friend, he needs me. Help me find my friend. Um, uh, I guess, uh, but you really need to leave. I can't leave until I find my friend, sir. You need to find my friend. Okay, what does he look like? A boy. He is young. A young boy. You need to find him. Hurry. It's about to get messy in here. It's about to get messy? What do you mean? It... It is about to be very messy. Just hurry, sir. There is no time to explain. You must find my friend. Okay, okay. I'm hurrying. Now stay here. I'll be back. Man. Just when I thought of, I just had to clean up a mess in the school. Some girl breaks into the school late at night and now she sends me on a wild goose chase to find her friend? A young boy? The girl looked like a teenager, though. Why would her friend be a small boy? Unless it's her brother, but then why would she say her brother? Where would this kid be? Maybe he's in the light booth? Wait, where does this go to? Oh, wow. 
Oh, wow, okay, so he's not in the auditorium. And he's not in the light booth. Where would this kid be? This school's way too big. And without Kib, I don't know how much of it I want to explore. Uh, little boy! Little boy! Are you out here? Emily's friend! I'm looking for you! Hello? Oh god. Oh god. There's some spirits up there. Just focus on the mess. Just focus on the mess. Okay, um... Hello, little boy! Let's close these. Little boy! Where are you? I'm janitor, I'm looking for you! Uh, Emily's trying to find you! He's nowhere to be seen. He's not responding to anything I say. Huh. Custodial. I've never been in here and I'm a janitor. Let's see if he's in here anywhere. Hello, little boy? Hmm. This is just a closet. Just, just tons of closet space. Little boy! Oh! God, you scared me! Uh, hello, little boy. Daddy, is that you? Uh, sorry, kid. I, I think you're confused. Why did you kill mommy, daddy? Why? Was she a bad girl? Um, I'm not your dad. and I can help you find him. Daddy's gonna hurt you! Daddy's gonna hurt you! Daddy's gonna hurt you! Daddy's gonna hurt you! I'm sorry! I- Oh my god! What is this- What's up with this kid? Oh god! What was that? Did you see that? What was that? I heard something. Let me go- Let me go check on that kid. I think I just freaked out. He's just a kid. Okay. Deep breath. Let's go check on him. Uh, Johnny, I'm sorry I freaked out. Johnny? Wait, where did he go? He was just here a second ago! Johnny! Johnny! Oh my god! Did he... Did, 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 did he vanish? Did that kid just vanish? Johnny! He's nowhere to be seen! Oh my god! Was he a... Was he a, a spirit? Oh no... I don't- I, I can't be here alone. Oh, Chef Nancy's in here. Oh, God. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna ask her. I'm gonna try to set stuff straight with Chef Nancy. I'm gonna tell her she's dead. And see if I can get her to release her spirit and maybe I can cleanse this school. Maybe that's the mess I have to focus on. Uh, Nancy. Hello, good sir. How are you doing tonight? Nancy, I want to talk to you about something. What is it? You're not alive. You're dead. I know this may be hard to hear. I'm dead? What do you mean I'm dead? I'm Chef Nancy. I have... I cook all the f meals here at Sleepy Hollow High. I have to be alive. You died in a kitchen fire in the 80s. No. No! You have to be mistaken. Can I cook you anything, honey? Maybe you just need to eat something. <sighs> Nancy. You can let go. I release you. You release me? Wait! What's happening? I feel funny! What's going on? No! No! I don't wanna go! I wanna stay! No! Oh my god! That worked! That worked! I released Nancy! She's gone now! She's no longer gonna roam the hallways of Sleepy Hollow High! Oh my god! Am I onto something here? Maybe I have to release all the spirits, and then I truly cleanse the mess! Maybe that what that's what Janitor Dan's talking about. Just focus on the mess. These ghosts are making a huge mockery of the school, so they're the mess. And if I can get rid of them, maybe I can save Sleepy Hollow High. And my job will become a lot easier. I guess I'm gonna have to go bust some ghosts.